if you break your tire, do you replace the whole car? No, you change the tire. That's the same thing with the AirPods. The battery is going to die one day, but you don't replace the whole thing. You just change the battery, right? That gets me riled up a little bit. <laughs> I think that electronic waste is absolutely shocking. And through my engineering projects, I want to show that it's possible to make electronics repairable. A few decades ago, they used to be, but now they're not. And I think we should bring back this mentality to what's currently being made. Uh, when I was a kid, I used to play video games a lot and I wanted more. So I started hacking them. My friends saw that and uh, one of them approached me and said, hey, listen, uh, I see that you're good with electronics and uh, this world. I have this broken iPhone, can I give it to you and you fix it? Of course, I always like a good challenge, so I went on the internet, I researched like how to fix an iPhone, and then this started a whole journey, like for years I fixed phones for people. Um, and then I finished my high school diploma and I wanted to know more about it. So not just fixing without understanding what's actually going on. And so I researched all the degrees that were available at EPFL, and there was one called Microengineering. It's a mix of computer science, electrical and mechanical engineering. And I just wanted to know as much as possible and have a wide net of knowledge. I really liked the theoretical aspect of things, but I feel like I was missing something when I was not doing something with my hands. While I was studying at EPFL, I had the opportunity to go to China for a summer and I went to the biggest electronics market in the world. And when I was there, everything was just moving so fast, left and right, people were building products. So when I came back, I had this idea that was engraved in my brain that you can build anything you want if you have the right tools. And so I set out the task to build my own workshop to turn ideas into reality.